Good morning, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful queen. I am here to give you pointers, but first things first, your girl just woke up, so coffee. You definitely want to stay caffeinated. And I know I should be probably be saying, oh my God, you should like totally stay hydrated. But I'm just not there yet in my health journey. So if you want to stay hydrated, absolutely. But over here, we're just staying caffeinated. Oh, that's bad. Okay. I should edit that out, but I won't. Um, caffeine, okay? Caffeine. Caffeine is great. Second thing is you need to not, not ignore your emotions. Like, if you are feeling angry, it's okay to express that. If you're feeling sad, it's okay to express that. And if you're feeling happy, it's okay to express that. Like, whew, it's okay to be in tune with your emotions. There is absolutely nothing wrong with that. Oh, Sorry, some scam likely was calling me. They're the only people that call me. That's sad. But. So what you want to do is you're caffeinated, right? Or hydrated. I should be saying hydrated, but this girl needs her caffeine. You're caffeinated. You are in tune with your emotions. And you, like, you're able to identify, like, what is wrong. Like, a lot of times when you see me doing, you like, the, like, little hip drops, I'm angry. <laughs> Like, I'm angry for a variety of reasons. I am one angry person. <laughs> and um, so this helps me. Like, the anger just adds to the movement. And you can feel it. So let's let's choose one, one move to practice. Let's choose, you know, our hip drops, right? And all you're doing is you're alternating which hip is dropping. So you're going to go one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Doo, doo, doo. And just think about something you're angry about. And anger is not a bad thing. Anger is your body's way of letting you know that somebody overstepped, okay? Somebody overstepped boundaries. Somebody, like, disrespected you. Somebody... Um, just cross the line. Um, anger is good. Anger is not bad. Okay? Um, now we are responsible for how we approach anger. Or just dancing. Right? We're not being violent with our angry emotions. We're just expressing it in a different way. So, again, get up with me. I hope you're doing this with me. So, you're like standing and you're going to go one two, three, four, and just drop that hip. And whatever is making you angry, whether it's your coworker, um, a boyfriend, an ex-boyfriend, just think about what is making you angry and just imagine that you are kicking them out of your space, okay? If you actually want to kick the negative energy out of your space, you probably want to do, um, probably want to push them out like this. It's like a hip lift, only with a kick at the end, right? So you're lifting your hip, but you're also making it go out. Ready? One, two, three. Out. Out. Like you're kicking everything out of your space because you need to protect your space at all costs, okay? What are we doing? We are protecting our space at all costs. I hope that helped. Mwah! Love you, queen.